In the farm fields near Mount Vernon, scientists are working to build better bread. But bread is science. It's physics, it's chemistry, it's biology, it's alive. Dr. Stephen Jones is a wheat breeder and baker and director of the Washington State University Bread Lab. Since 2011, it's explored the science of tasty whole grain loaves. The Bread Lab is a place for us to meet, first of all. So we bring farmers, millers, maltsters, bakers, chefs, scientists, students, community members into one location and talk about bread. One of the lab's missions, developing bread that's affordable, nutritious, and delicious. And this place has gotten the attention of some heavy hitters. Bill Gates has toured the Bread Lab. Patagonia's food line, Patagonia Provisions, sponsors research here. The Bread Lab even developed a healthier flour tortilla for Chipotle. Pull it off like just like a piece of duct tape. Bread Lab doesn't just work with big name clients, it also puts bread making back where it began, into the hands of home bakers. King Arthur Flour has classes here year round. Part of coming to these classes is to take the intimidation out there. Um, and having the instructors and the assistants to stand by and say, you know, you got this. It's going to feel like this, but it's gonna make beautiful bread. The students in this Cooking with Whole Grains class will go home with whole wheat loaves, scones, gingerbread, and something more. It sends me back to my childhood, actually. I mean, just thinking, I mean, that sounds, sounds so corny, but really, uh, a lot of my memories, good memories back in Kentucky, was spent watching my grandmother make buttermilk biscuits and pancakes and all that kind of stuff. There's more to the bread lab than science, just like there's more to some bread than flour water and yeast. We work with many bakers that talk about the love in their bread. So there's some, some love involved. There's history, tradition, there's, there's tremendous beauty. And, and what I like to say in the lab too is, is we have beauty. There's, there's room for beauty in what we do.